week's episode of Smosh Pit Weekly. My name is Mari, and I'll be wrapping up some of the best articles seen on the Smosh Pit this week. Make sure you check out the links down below to see the full articles on SmoshPit.com. If you have ever seen Attack on Titan, you know things get pretty damn intense. <laughs> Characters are routinely viciously killed, mangled, and eaten like a piece of beef jerky by the giant murderous titan. <laughs> Creatures that will stop at nothing to devour every last human. <laughs> they also run around butt ass naked and don't have genitalia. <laughs> Well-known cosplayer D. Pity, who you might recognize from his amazing Deadpool videos, has taken the brutal and violent attack on Titan and has made it damn adorable. Enjoy! <laughs> surprised that Mikasa was knocking over Colossal Titans even as a four-year-old because she is pure badass. <laughs> Baby Mikasa does not even use her 3D maneuvering gear. She is killing a Titan with her cuteness, which, though arguable, I'm pretty sure Levi cannot do. Well guess what? You're five foot a bitch! Playing The Sims is interesting. You augment your Sims to look a certain way, place them in houses, and help direct their moods and satisfy their desires. You basically simulate life. <laughs> it's a control freak's absolute dream. You know, that's just like uh, your opinion, man. But what if The Sims' life was real life? Life uh, does not stop and start you know, at your convenience, you I, miserable uh, piece of sh. Not to worry, the Warp Zone is here to show us what that might exactly be like. Hey man, what's wrong? Well, this place is great and all, but I'm not really a fan of that couch. Whoa! There's no denying that the convenience of instantly changing furniture, your hairstyle, and outfits would be absolutely fantastic. Oh, cool! Let me try! Nachos for breakfast? Fact! I can tell you that my lazy ass has tried to will cooked food into reality many, many a time. Come on, Thanksgiving dinner. Sure, that's nice, but there could be a bad side to having a Sims life in real life, right? <laughs> it's just different, okay? Katika Lou. Baba! Oh yeah, that is bad. That head is... Instant babies, that is, that's bad. And let's not forget that even though being a sim might feel like you're in control, let's not forget that some overlord is controlling your every mood, action, and happiness. Why is this happening? What kind of merciless creator being would allow such a thing? Who is responsible? Who are you? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's creepy. Ava is stinker! Creepy! According to Urban Dictionary, One Direction is a UK boy band that makes girls all over the world sexually frustrated and angry. I have heard a song or two of theirs. The story of my life, I take her home. The voice of an angel. It is known that a biological trigger in prepubescent and tween aged girls goes off at the mere sound of lead singer Harry Styles' voice. Bad Your voice is like a combination of Fergie and Jesus. The vast majority of Directioners in the world just happen to be teenage and tween girls. And since many of these tweens and teens can't drive yet, sometimes a dad has to step up and take his girls to the One Direction concert. This video is a tribute to those brave fathers. Their tears are filling up their glasses No expression, no expression They are on the front lines enduring thousands of screaming girls And let me tell you that is not a good sound And boy band music they don't give a sh** about All because they love their daughters Drown my sorrow, no tomorrow, no tomorrow 
that's it for this week, you guys. Make sure you check out the links to see the full videos and articles on SmoshPit.com. Questions for this week are all right here. And you can follow, like, and interact with me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. And to see me and other videos from throughout the week, check out last week's Smosh Pit Weekly, as well as Game Bang and Mario Craft on the Smosh Games channel. Have an awesome week, you guys, and I'll see you next Saturday for an all-new episode. Mata daishune! Questions, 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 questions. Yeah, I'm not scared of regular clowns like circus clowns. I actually knew a professional circus clown and they're great performing artists. But the scary ass clowns like It and Sweet Tooth, yeah, those guys. Happy birthday this week to Casey, Steven, Lucy, Lucas, Sheridan, Eric, Brooke, and Cody. Have an awesome one, you guys. Yay!